All right, guys, so up next is Pit Fighter for the Genesis. It came out in 1991 and was developed by Atari Games and published by Tengen or Tengen or whatever. It is a fighting type of game and there are 11 matches. Uh, there's also two game modes. There's normal and practice. I went with normal, of course. Uh, my challenge was a deathless run. And I'd also like to point out that Evan Nixon, also known as Brave or Grave, is the one who requested this run. So let's see how that goes. All right, guys, pit fighter time, normal and practice. I'm going to go with Ty here. So if I can just clear this guy without any damage, I'm going to have a good start and a possibly very enjoyable run. Okay, so we landed a hit. Get rid of it, you know what I'm saying? And I'm too close to the crowd. So apparently even though the fight is over, if there's a piece of shit on the sides with a knife or a stick, they can beat you up. Had to learn that the hard way. Alright, so now it's the bitch time. So she has a knife, I gotta watch out. Even though I'm in power pill mode. Notice my record and the time that I'm having now. Fuck! That is one. Wow, did the fucking slut actually fucking hit me in the back? Wow, man, this game, I fucking swear, man, is the most infuriating piece of shit. I had a run just fine until that fucking had to happen, of course. Now this stage is just riddled, riddled with crap. Okay, so I gotta watch out here. So I gotta regain the loss from the bitch fight.
So this guy here I can actually do without any damage. You fucking piece of shit loser! Missed the barrel, plus he hits me, fuck. But now he's in a corner, which fucking sucks. Still terrible though because I lost a notch. And usually I kill this guy super easy. Miss the barrel and he hits me. Way to go, blue. Okay, so fucking mystery of the life here. Should always go upwards, you dumb fuck. Because this guy can really take away your HP real quick. Always go to the top, never go face to face, he's always gonna punch you first. Like I just demonstrated and that I know about, but I keep fucking up there. Lost another notch for nothing. Look how she flies to the moon. Ah, oh, that double piece of shit KO crap happening. Come on, man. Where are you, though? Oh my god, come on though! I lost two fucking notches because of that. It's like we ram into each other and then we fly off. Like, what the fuck is that? Who decided to write that fucking code? If smashing together, fly off, you fucking dumb. too far in the crowd there. If I can land this guy without any damage. That could have been bad. Oh my god, the most frustrating game ever. Man.
course, picking up that barrel is not going to work. So, he's going to be picking up for me. fly after me, so I was like blowing the wind. Alright, so I got half of my HP for the end boss, half of my HP for the end boss, which isn't so shabby. I've actually had this before in the past and I failed, even though some fights I actually kill him without any damage, getting hit to me. So let's see how that goes. Getting some damage here. Dying, baby! There you fucking go, guys. One of the hardest, hardest, hardest fucking games I've ever played. Well, actually, not if you die and stuff. You know, I can do this easily with one death or whatever. But doing this without dying... It's a whole different fucking story, man. Very, very fucking hard. I hope it was, you know, enjoyable for the short run that it was, but wow, I have paid the price many, many times. And as you can see, it says level 3. I think that's the handicap. It might be the difficulty, I'm not too sure, but... Wow, what a fucking real pain. 11 fights without replenishing your health. Are you goddamn serious, though? Uh, between the SNES and the Genesis, I find that this is the better version, but holy fuck, on the SNES at least you regain some health after some fights. Oh man, I wish I can tell you the 
pain that I've been through with this game. But anyways, hope you enjoyed and uh, see you around, guys.